The Swedish Counter-Strike scene holds legendary status. In a game that has a rich tradition, Sweden carved its name in history from the very beginning. home to some of the most iconic names in the game. Hottie, Zet, Forrest, Spawn, Heaton. The list goes on, but Swedish Counter-Strike has never been about individual skill. It's about team play, and there have been plenty of great teams with it. From the early 2000s up to the end of 1.6, Teams like SK Gaming, Ninjas in Pajamas, and Fnatic would go on to make Sweden the greatest country in the world in terms of success. Global Offensive is no different. NIP and Fnatic both had their own eras of dominance early on. Ninjas in Pajamas dominated the scene from the get-go claiming a historical 87-0 map win record. An impressive achievement showing the world that the legendary organization was back for real. Fnatic claimed their spot in the history book by being the first team to win two consecutive major tournaments, pushing their total number of major titles up to three, a number that no other team have been able to reach since. Despite all that success, the Swedish scene has struggled over the last couple of years, and it has looked like a full recovery would be something of a miracle. Titles have still been won, but they can only be considered as odd upsets with the lack of consistency that the teams have shown. The only real success story as of late has been for the Swedes in phase. Star player Olaf Meister and coach Robin have done well for themselves in their multinational team. But there might still be hope for the others as well with the recent roster changes that has been made. With a total of 16 people playing and coaching in four different teams, Sweden is well represented in its capital city of Stockholm. What a sick right out. Oh my god, JW, he gets the second one. The assistant trapped in the corner now. 20 seconds. What? Yes, yes, are you kidding? Get right letting up through with that one, two, goes with a triple camp right. And the world looks on to see if history will be made once more in what people call the home of Counter-Strike.